Spring is here, and with it comes more light and open windows, maybe time to freshen up your decor. Well, for that, designer Carla Dreyer is back with us to help. Hello there. Hello, thanks for having me. So from a designer's perspective, Carla, what does, what does spring mean? You know what's interesting? I almost think of it more as a psychological perspective. Like, you know, in the new year, I don't feel like it's the new start. I feel like spring to people that I talk to, it's the new start. So that's the time we make changes sometimes in life. We make changes, like we were talking about, to our clothing. And I think we should make a few changes to our decor. Just like we put away the winter coat and we bring out the spring coat, let's do the same our home All right. to inspire us. After you wash the windows because the sunshine coming okay, through the windows shows, <laughs> yes, shows the streaks too. I it's have that going so, on right so now. It's so true. So what are some of the trends So I year? want to talk about the trends and, and again trends are things of just what speaks to you. Doesn't mean you have to change everything but it's fun to know about them. Woven. So anything woven, anything sustainable, anything textured. So a few different things. One is a rug. Now you might not think of changing your rug for spring but yep. like we were talking about a coat. I mean why not? You can roll this up, put it downstairs, bring it out. This, this is beautiful. Is, this though. is beautiful. And I was saying to you, I got the um, these things at HomeSense. This was, I think, $50. So it doesn't have to be a huge investment. You can do it for a good price point. Um, if you don't want to do the rug, that's too much. You could go woven in the pillows. You can go woven in the basket. Uh, lighting. I know lighting. This is a lamp. Isn't that so cool? Yeah, like above your gorgeous. kitchen pendant, like if you were going to make a change. And again, this is under $100. Um, so it, it can be something that you can change up with the Okay. Season. Oh, I oh right now this one's a little, little shaky. Okay. okay. We, well, we wouldn't be putting it like that. It'd be hanging anyway. And what else? So other little okay, so, change of picture. So art. Um, I see a lot of bare walls when I go do consultations. And I think that bringing art into your home really does invoke so much feeling and your sense and your sense of well-being that I also think it should be changed up for spring. You know, see something that you like. And it doesn't have to be intimidating. Again, art can be affordable. These right. are affordable pieces if it speaks to you and it can really provide inspiration for other areas of your home. Um, and I just wanted to show this is actually a wallpaper but this is completely what's on trend. It's birds, wow. Wow. birds and coral which is the thing oh, for the or other way down. around. <laughs> yeah okay there's the bird. So we if you want to go with really the spring trend this year Get some birds, get some coral. Like you could cover a uh, one cupboard door with this it would or be something. So cool. wooden and then just leave it as well, an Well, you know accent. what I'm going to do is I'm going to frame this and oh, put this I above see. my couch. So I'm going to get a simple frame. And yeah. then so if you don't want to commit to the whole wallpaper, just get a simple frame. Right. And that again, change that up. The new Easy. season. Easy. OK. And you've got some more texture pillows here. And then here. textiles. So if one thing you're going to do, change up your textiles, take away that faux fur blanket, put on something that's the, you know, the color of the season is coral, like we talked about, the pinks, the pastels, and it just lighter and brighter to freshen up. Fresh? These are, these are So which are second. real, which are fake? There's some real in there. It, is there these are real tulips. Look yeah. at and I happened to is coordinate. It, you that worked out very well. So so well. So cool. biophilia is the hottest thing for 2019. I think because we're so connected on our phones, we want to bring in nature. Biophilia. Uh, biophilia. I had to look it up. I have to admit. Okay. So okay. So, so it's it? bringing it's bringing a connection to nature and people wanting to do that in in their homes. So plants are the thing to okay. do, but sometimes it's hard to take care of. So what the stores have done um, is, it look real. is they made it look real. So again, I got all these things, home sense, they look real. You can add some faux with some with some real if you want, like I did with the tulips, or go foraging, like I did this week in my mother's backyard and cut some, you know, yeah, just branches easy. and that's just easy. put them in and some you're good. Some fun vases for yeah. sure. And a lot of people eating outdoors. Eating as out, well. so let's bring, yes, I can't wait to eat outdoors. So melamine plates, they've come a long way as well. So. You you know, they used to be a thing of kind of, oh, we don't want to buy those outdoor plates. Now they're so pretty. They're coming in all those spring colors um, and just make you feel good. So do you have yeah. a favorite spring activity? You know what? I am a seawall person. You know what? Even a glimpse of sun, even yesterday afternoon and down. I love and flowers, fresh flowers every week. That's my thing. Yeah. Carla, so nice to see you. Thank you. Nice to see you.